McMillan, we're in Colorado Springs for the 90th running of the Pikes Peak International Hill Climb. You know, for 18 years I've been coming to this race. I crafted my professional career on, on being a privateer here for, for nine plus years before gaining sponsorship enough to put together a full-fledged effort to go for uh, a decent victory. Um, now to, to come back here with um, an opportunity to win a class uh, and not even consider the overall until the week played itself out is it, just a remarkable result. And uh, you know, it's, it's the never say die attitude and, and that's what gave us the victory this weekend. You know, strapped in the, the car at the start line, I asked my crew chief, I said, give me a weather report for the top of the mountain. I heard that it had been raining uh, and, and I wanted to know if the rain conditions were still there, if they were getting heavier or less. We were choosing to leave the line on slick tires. So with the knowledge that there was rain on the top of the hill, I pushed the first three quarters of the run harder than I ever have to try to make up a buffer time, knowing that I'd have to be safe in the rain when we got there. When I got to the rain, it was so severe, I threw away the overall condition of, of trying to get an overall victory and just focused on getting the class win, the smart decision, but still pushed hard enough to whereas we had control with a slick tire on a wet road.
you know, I crossed the finish line in the rain and I was in the face of the camera like, oh, I was so mad because I, I considered the overall victory to be not ours, but we still had a class win. A um, couple of minutes later, they were announcing the times and, and uh, they gave me uh, Romain Dumas's time in the Porsche with a, a 9.46.18. And the guy's like, do you want to know your time? I'm like, yeah, I do. He says, 9.46.1. And he paused and he goes, six. And I was just, ah, could not believe it. Amazing opportunity, uh, amazing run. And just a credit to everyone, to Hankook Tires. Without them, we wouldn't even been up here this year. Uh, we were just about sitting out the entire beat. So, you know, for Hankook, for their support and for incredible rubber that they give us to, to run up this mountain so fast in a, in a production car. Um, thank you to Romain for pushing me so hard and the Porsche team uh, and to my team, to Hyundai, to Hancock, to Pulse, um, to all the guys on the team. This is a great opportunity. It's taken me 18 years to achieve this. I, I crafted my professional career on being a rookie up here or for being a privateer up here for eight years. Woo! And uh, now I have an amazing team and amazing support of sponsors behind me. And uh, to all of you that are doing the same right now, live out your dreams. Yay! The best thing about this result this year is the road has changed to 100% tarmac. My background has been in rallying and drifting, sliding a car, extreme car control, but not really crafted for, for going fast on, say, racing conditions, grip driving. Uh, you've seen the best in the world come over here this year to challenge Pikes Peak with this new change of road surface. And for me to, to show that I'm an adaptive driver, uh, that was my number one goal, to prove people wrong that I can grip drive. For next year, it's wide open. I'm a free agent. I don't have a contract next year, so uh, we're excited. We want to come back, but we want to be back in Unlimited. Cross the river and cross it slow. Been looking hard for the way to go.